Over Easter, it's really important to take a step back from your home learning and try to relax. Only complete work if it will help keep your mind active and do everything you can to have a rest. Today, I'd like to set you some challenges, challenges that I would like you all to rise to over the Easter break to keep us all active and busy. But first, I want to mention our new newsletter that was emailed home to parents through my head today. It can also be found on the website and on Facebook. And the idea is, again, to find new ways to improve how we communicate with one another. The newsletter will focus on our school, our students and our community. And if you have any questions regarding the newsletter, please just email me. Our YouTube channel continues to develop. I talk about it in the newsletter and I focus on the fact that through our YouTube channel, you can find National Theatre Live, an initiative where you get to experience free plays every Thursday. Ideas to keep us active through the Joe Wicks lessons and also through our own PE department's initiatives. Recipes to try out at home and support your family and our extensive audiobook library. All year seven and eight students are challenged to create a 2D design. Download the CAD package for free and send your ideas to Miss Ball and Mr. Anson. This is an Easter challenge for each one of you. Good luck. Congratulations to our year nine students who graduated from the Brilliant Club. A fantastic achievement that has showcased talent and independence. More information can be seen on our website. Well done to all the Year 9 students involved. Please continue to look after yourselves and each other. Focus on talking and listening to one another. Get active as often as you can. Take notice of the things that you enjoy and embrace them. Keep learning and give time to your family and your friends. If you need anything at all, you know where we are. Email us. I want to finish by just talking through the challenges that I would like you to rise to over Easter. Firstly, watching at least one of the National Theatre Live productions on our YouTube channel. Secondly, completing the PE department challenge by exercising for at least 30 minutes each day over Easter. And finally, to listen to one or more audiobooks from our library on RCS Tube. Please, the Raw Marsh way is to rise to challenges. Take this opportunity and do just that. I want to finish just by emphasising that this has been a challenging time. The support we have all shown one another speaks volumes about our staff, our students, our parents and our community. I'm so very proud of the work happening in our school in our community and beyond. If anyone has any questions, please continue to email me. I hope everyone is staying safe and keeping well. Best wishes.